Hey, what's good, y'all? I'm All City, and thank you for tuning in. 2K recently sent out an anti-cheat update, but it seems like with all these updates and gameplay changes that us regular 2K players had to experience over the last few years, shot timing and all that other good stuff, it's not doing much to deter cheaters from taking over the game. We finna get into all the details. Y'all be sure to drop a like and drop a sub if you can. I would first like to reference this tweet sent out by Ja. It says, I am being told that some known streamers from the 2K community are using a Zen or Titan on stream. Like folks just don't even care anymore. Ja quoted his own post by saying, sad to say, but this is still happening. When will there be repercussions for cheating on 2K24? I would like to reference this next post from Ja saying, cheaters have caved into using dribble scripts and auto green scripts at the same time. As if shooting nothing but greens is not enough, players out there also have a dribble script, a script to help you dribble much easier and shoot auto greens. AO Pass TMB recently got accused of cheating. In this post, it goes on to say, AO Pass TMB is denying the allegations of using a dribble script. However, I've had multiple people DM me saying that he is using a Zen slash Titan to cheat. There's also a rumor that AO Pass is no longer with TMB. From what I understand, he recently got kicked. I would like to reference this next post from Slash saying, so why can't 2K not invest in high level anti-cheat? Also, if the most popular form of cheating is a meter script, then why not let us just see our opponent's meter? It's obviously no secret that cheating is commonplace on 2K24. And if you guys had to take your best guess on how 2K approached and responded to cheaters on 2K24, what do you think it'd be? 2K, they recently dropped an anti-cheat update, but this update is mainly directed to PC players. If you guys feel like console players have it bad with cheaters, then oh my god, they go absolutely bonkers on PC. 2K recently sent out this post and Oh man, I think you guys are about to go crazy with this one. It says, in an effort to create a more fair and balanced NBA 2K24 experience for all players on PC, please be aware that some new protections have recently been implemented. Players who attempt to play NBA 2K24 for PC while running cheating tools or unauthorized third-party software may now be redirected to the NBA 2K Player Code of Conduct webpage or experience gameplay limitations in which passing the ball becomes unsuccessful come on is 2k serious man do they not understand that folks actually add these scripts to their players because they have absolutely no intention of passing the ball they have a dribble script and an auto green script there's absolutely zero reason for them to pass the ball in the first place but 2k thinks the way in which to address anti-cheat on pc is to limit them from passing the ball for that they should just award them vc they should just give them an auto vc script because if the only repercussion for cheaters on PC for 2K24 is limitations on their passing. To me, that just sounds like a W for cheaters. It looks like the PC version for 2K24 is gonna get a lot worse before it gets better. 2K, it seems like they have absolutely zero clue on how to fix this huge problem. And in their low effort attempt to fix the problem for PC players, it seems like console cheaters, they're just getting a pass. I mean, there has to be a way to fix cheating on 2K. If you guys have ideas on how to implement anti-cheat for 2K24 and further iterations of 2K, please sound off in the comment section below. All of this stuff is just getting out of hand. I will be going live a little later on today to talk some more about this stuff. Y'all be sure to tune in. Y'all be sure to keep it locked. If you guys are tired of running with randoms and you're looking for players to run with on NBA 2K, come on out and join our Discord. We'd love to have you. The link for Discord will be in the description below. I want to thank you guys so much for tuning in and y'all be sure to keep it locked right here at All City Live TV because we got a bunch more NBA 2K24 news, information, and updates coming your way. Drop a like and drop a sub on your way out. I'll catch you guys on the next video or live stream. Easy, y'all.